encourage and inspire and share your stories and to introduce them to a man who will never ever leave them and to a man who will give them everlasting life. I use my platform today to most say do gospel and I say to them gospel is in me. Jesus went in places and areas where they used to talk about him and say wow why would he be over there and why would he but he went to those places to tell the people about a God that is mighty about a God that is powerful about a God who is a miracle worker I'm going to do just that because a lot of the people today have sold their souls for power, for money my grandmother used to always sit me down and give me these long talks, and boy, don't I miss them. But I'm glad she did. Because when we leave this world, we can't take none of that stuff with us. My reward is to have everlasting life, to be able to see God. Not to get caught up in power, to get caught up in money. So today forgive me but that song just blessed me so much and it just lets me know that we serve a God that's greater and bigger uh, there's a young lady by the name of Ja'Kalen Carr and she has a song called um, God is bigger he's bigger than any situation he's bigger than cancer he's bigger than AIDS um, he, he's bigger than any situation that, that you're dealing with but you have to seek him to seek him so i just wanted to bless somebody today um because i never know who's watching and you never know what people are going through somebody woke up this morning and their hearts were so heavy i, t I had to encourage my own little brother today and i asked god while driving him to work i said like, give me the words to say that will encourage a young black man to number one keep fighting and to number two seek after you more every day so Erica Campbell, I want to thank you for that song. And he did lay it all down. He laid it all down just for us. He did it. He had to do it. Um, that's my word for the day, Facebook Live. I don't do Facebook Live often. But I was moved to go on Facebook Live and, and just play that song and worship. I'm not, I'm not ashamed. I'm not ashamed of the gospel. I'm not ashamed to praise his name. I'm not ashamed. So I come on Facebook Live where I know anybody can see to say that I will always worship him and I will always praise him. Because if it had not been, eh, after all that I've been through, after all that I've been through, if he doesn't do anything else, he's done enough. So every day that you let, wake up to live, God allows you to live to see another day. When your feet hit the ground, give him glory give him honor tell him thank you and tell him to just you know prepare you for whatever the enemy is going to throw your way that day because the enemy will throw all kinds of stuff <laughs> but as long as you stay in your word and stay on your knees and stay into worship and prayer you'll be okay i have a cousin by the name of bobby barino who's in the hospital right now he needs a heart he needs a heart and I've been praying about this thing. But the other day I spoke to him on the phone and he was saying some powerful stuff. I was like, boy, you might come up out of there preaching. But he needs a heart. The doctor told him that his heart will not make it for another 12 months. He won't, he won't live. And I got depressed and I got stressed. And, but then I had to think about that thing. We serve a God that's bigger. Bigger than that situation. And the Bible says if we all come together, one can chase a thousand, two can chase ten thousand. If we all come together and just begin to pray for the world, pray for our children, pray for our black men. I mean, uh, 
we have to come together and actually do it. We got to stop talking about it and going out and standing in the streets and protesting. And man, get on your knees and pray. So I ask that you help me pray for my cousin, Bobby Barino. Some in High Point know of him as Tavares Barino. Um, we call him Bobby. That, that God will move on his behalf. We're going to raise money. I'm going to do a show. Later on today, I'm going to post um, I'm gonna post something where if, if you can. Um, and if God lays it on your heart to help us, you know, donate so that he can um, be put on the list to, to receive a new heart. So there you have it, Facebook Live. Um, I pray that your days are blessed. Um, and that some something in this message, you know, has inspired you. I put a smile on your face. If you want to hear that song, the name of the song is called The Question by Erica Campbell. Um, so God bless you guys. And I pulled over. Now I need to get back on the road. These people probably think I'm crazy. But I pulled over and now I'm going to go home and go into the piano room with my MD and prepare to go and sing tomorrow in D.C. for us. A very intimate um, engagement but I hope that God will just use me to continue to bless you guys through music and my story and um, yeah God is bigger than anything that you're dealing with all right stay up no matter what's going down